So Dog walked down Pennsylvania Avenue, came to the White House, scratched on the door, and guess who opened it? Two little girls. And they said, Daddy, Daddy, can we keep him? And from behind the door you hear, yes, we can. That's the ending to First Dog. That dog. And doesn't he look exactly like my friend Tugger? Yes. In fact, this dog is Bo. Bo is the new first family dog. I wrote this book. My name is J. Patrick Lewis. I wrote it with my daughter, Beth Zapatello. And it was illustrated by Tim Bowers. Really beautiful illustrations with Sleeping by Sleeping Bear Press. It's available, oh, I'm happy to tell you, it's available in your bookstores right now. I dedicated this book to all the members of the rescue community who spend so many hours and so much time uh, finding homes for homeless dogs. This book, by the way, was featured in USA Today, and it was on the Colbert Report. In short, it's about the first dog, this dog, who's looking to find the perfect home. So he goes all over the world. Yes, he does. He goes all over the world trying to find the perfect dog, the perfect home, and he meets all sorts of wonderful dogs, like this one who's licking my ear. And, but he never seems to be able to find the right home. So he comes home and he goes into the park, falls asleep, wakes up, and he sees a newspaper that says, First Family Looking for a Dog. So he walks down Pennsylvania Avenue. That's how he becomes first dog living with the first lady, the first daughters, and the president of the United States. My favorite dog, by the way, did I say this? Say this? My favorite dog is a French poodle because I love my own dog, who is a French poodle, a standard poodle, her name is Luna, and a Bichon named Pearl, all white. Hey, do you have a favorite dog? Do you have a favorite dog breed? Then why don't you go to my website, look at that, www.firstdogwhitehouse.com. You just click on that and you can tell me all about your favorite dog. Anyway, look for First Dog in a bookstore near you. It's there now. And thanks for watching. And I'm so happy that I have such attentive listeners, my canine friends. So see you soon in a bookstore with First Dog. Good night.